Welcome to Iran, 2019. Hi guys, thank you so much for watching my video. That guy's ruining it, okay. It's time. <laughs> it's the time that we have all been waiting for. I am going to Iran. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. What the hell are you doing, girl? You, <laughs> a United States citizen, you who just graduated college, you who have your whole life ahead of you are going to a risky country? Yes. <laughs> but if you're seeing this video, that means I went and I came back and I uploaded this and I'm good. So we're good, sis. And there is so many Iran videos coming. Be excited. So this is my travel vlog. And um, yeah. I hope you are excited for my year on videos. I'm definitely excited to go and make them for you and hopefully everything goes well. Positive energy, positive thoughts, and let's go. I got my coffee bean coffee. I always get this when I'm in the airport. So excited. They have paper straws now, save the turtles. And I'm so tired already. This is so long. It's so beautiful. I have hair. And uh, we're on the first flight. Afternoon for flight deck. We're going to be uh, pushing back uh, shortly on our way to uh, Dallas Fort Worth. Right now it's 12:15. So far, my mom has lost my jacket. I did it. Okay, she didn't, but she did. But it's okay. It's one of my favorite jackets. You lost your jacket. I should have. I should have had my jacket, but whatever. That's what's happened so far. But I have a blanket, so we're good. What is that? Oh, modern Mexican? Yum. Let's find some modern burgers. <laughs> Dallas, okay. <laughs> There's even a 7 Eleven. That's pretty cool. They even have a cute candy store. Oh my gosh. I love candy. <laughs> Before my mother lost my jacket. No. So <laughs> she did lost her jacket. So now I'm I uh, created this little room for myself. I actually like it. I'm under my blanket and I am watching TV. Oh, and we're eating Sour Patch Kids. It's kind of, we're having a good time watching some YouTube. We've been awake since 8 a.m. So it's been the long one and it hasn't even started and I want to die. <laughs> okay. Got a burger. This is my last meal in America. Pretty fitting watching my YouTube. 
being super annoying, but look at this burger. Wow. I just brushed my teeth because we're about to board and it's gonna be 16 hours, close to 17. I can't believe that. People are staring at me. Leave me alone. This is the line of people waiting to board our flight. This is me finishing my food over here. This flight we're about to get on is one of the longest flights in the whole world. And I'm already so exhausted by it. Here we go. So we just boarded our flight. What time is it? <laughs> it is 5.49. Fortunately guys, I don't have the window seat this time. We have the aisle and the middle seat. Which is better for bathroom and stuff, but I won't be able to film the takeoff and the landing. It's pink in here.7x Whoa. that was a scary walkway it feels good to walk didn't walk for about 14 hours um, my legs kept falling asleep but we're in Qatar gonna go find a lounge to hopefully get some sleep maybe even wash our face and do all those things I haven't been to this airport in a really long time I honestly don't remember the last time we flow with Qatar we usually go Turkish but it's pretty. I'm excited to show you guys. I slept for a little bit. Sorry, I'm talking to the camera. Now I'm gonna go do some stuff. Most of the time that we come here, we just kinda hang out at the airport. This time we decided to hang out in the lounge. And I'm gonna show you like that in a second whenever I get energy. <laughs> okay, so this lounge that we're in has a shower. I'm gonna go take a shower. I'm traveling for about 28 hours. Yeah, that's right. We have about five more hours here in Doha and then a one hour flight, so about six more hours. It's gonna be a 30 hour trip. 30, 34 hours, 34 hours total. Honestly, that last flight went by faster than I thought it would. I was super uncomfortable the whole time because the girl next to me kept like touching me and <laughs> I just couldn't sleep. But I just slept for a couple hours, so I'm happy. These are my toiletries. I have body wash, I have face wash, I'm gonna brush my teeth. I have new clothes that I'm gonna change into. I'm being judged. And then once I do all that, I'm gonna show you guys this airport because it's really cool. I'm all clean, I'm talking. 
keeping quiet because there are people out there but I'll talk to you more about this in a second but I feel good so this is a really long layover it's nine hours and I thought it was gonna be really bad but I'm really happy we came into this lounge um, I'll show you all the food and stuff in a second but just being able to shower while traveling for so long makes such a big difference, especially in my life. There's like water here, which is so important. We get as much water as we want and food and stuff. So yeah, I recommend this lounge or any lounge, honestly, they're all the same, but go to the cheapest one. to film this lounge for you guys but I'm really uncomfortable especially because there's a lot of Islamic women and I just don't want them to be sad but there's like a tech room there's a family room there's a quiet room um, here's a gist I gave you guys a gist me and my mom have found this little corner that nobody really has claimed because there's no plugs around here but the seats are so comfy I slept here for a couple hours you look pretty mom I think this lo these lounges are worth it because you spend at least like 10 to 20 dollars on food and water and this was 50 dollars so if you have the income girl it's worth it All right mom if if <laughs> just like all the great airports and especially middle eastern airports there's a beautiful duty-free section with all the luxury things and there's a random Aston Martin which is always really really hot so one thing this airport is famous for is this weird teddy bear sculpture I'm sure there's a story behind this and we can look into it after but Kinda of creepy. I love these little circular purses. Chic. Swarovski. Who doesn't need crystals while they're at the airport? So this looks like a little food court. There's a Burger King. There's always Burger Kings in the airports around um, in the Middle East. That's I'm fine with that. Airports are basically malls nowadays, but even better than malls because there's like liquor and stuff, which is always fun. I haven't been to this airport in a long time and I have never seen a lot of this stuff. That's a plush thing. That's crazy. Wow. I feel like I'm in Disney World. This is like a play area for kids. It's so cool. So much cool art. I love like usable art like this. Like people can sit on this. Oh my gosh. That's so cute! I love details! There's so many cute little cafes. Okay, just got some pasta, a little salad, some dessert. And then this is, this is a lemon mint drink, lime mint or something that's so good. Also got a Sprite and a water. I'm going all out. <laughs> so I'm excited. I know, this gold split. <laughs> My mom was looking. So we just left the lounge. We're headed to our gate. When are we taking off? An hour or two? Almost. 50 minutes till boarding. What time is it? Midnight? It's like 12.10. My mom's avoiding me. It's 12.10 here, but... For us, it's like 3 p.m.
I'm malfunctioning. I'm malfunctioning. Crisis averted. We're going to E24. So that way, Mom. We just got to our gate. And we're getting on the bus, you guys. Lord have mercy on my soul. Oh my gosh, that's literally our luggage. That's literally my bag. I made it. <laughs> I made it, you guys. Um, I'm in my house right now. I can't believe it. This whole trip has been such a daze. I don't know if it's because I was super tired or if like my life has just been so busy these past couple months, but I can't believe I'm here. I'm so happy, I'm so excited. Um, everything went really well in the airport. Super quick, we got our bags pretty quickly. Um, and now we are home. It is currently, it's 5 a.m. Doha time, which is where we just were. And it's 8.52 in Oklahoma City, which means it's been 36 hours about since we um, began this journey. And uh, 36 hours later, we are here, we're home, we're happy, we're safe, we're comfortable. I am about to eat a little something then take a nap, then wake up and um, take another shower, wash my hair, and just get into the groove of things. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm sorry I couldn't make it cooler or funner. I was just really tired and trying to deal with a 36 hour trip. Hope you guys are excited for my Iran videos. I cannot believe I'm here. I'm so excited. Please subscribe, get ready for them, dude. There's gonna be so many and they're gonna be so cool. I promise, you guys are thinking you haven't even filmed them yet, but you don't even know, girl. There's so many things I have planned, so many things coming that I think you're gonna love. So subscribe and um, like this video and welcome to Iran 2019. Let's hope that there's nothing bad gonna happen. Let's go eat something now. <laughs> we got fresh ash and, and fresh bread. Oh my gosh, the perfect thing to eat. That is beautiful. I'm thirsty. Okay.